What's going on everyone? Nick van Dutch here back with a new money glitch duplication from Tuto Fossil France. Before we get started, uh, guys, you have to have a lot of things. CAO office, office garage, a custom order shop inside your CEO office. You have to be in an invite only session. Also, you need a friend for in the session and you need to stack up allergies in your garage. So if you got that ready, guys, let's start the video. Okay, let's start this money making glitch guys. Step in your allergy. This one is fresh, it's free. And you want to make sure you go to inside your custom auto shop and modify this one to the maximum. You need to start from the beginning every each time when you want to perform this glitch. So it's gonna be a very expensive money glitch because this is very buggy also for the first time if you don't get it right. You have to start over again every single time to make a new elegy. It can cost you a lot of money if you get it wrong. So once again guys I'm speeding this forward because nothing interesting is seeing here. You just modify your allergy to the fullest if you have the money of course because one fully uh, upgraded allergy is gonna bring you about nine hundred fifty four thousand dollars so after that my friend is already entering a job and it doesn't matter what job it is he's waiting there and waiting for me to join him so I'm gonna finish my allergy up right here and when I finish it up I'm gonna hit options I'm gonna go to online gonna hover over players and in this session are all my friends here and I'm gonna join a friend that is in a job at the moment. You're gonna first see this alert screen and then the second one about this, you can't be invited to join this session. Once you've done that, you're gonna be spawned back right into your garage. Boom, right over here. So I'm gonna show you that this one is just the modified one with the door broken. And uh, right there, as you guys can see, is the normal allergy. So if you've seen this, it's totally normal. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna walk down to the blue circle to identify some things. So this is the first car, you're gonna place it to the second car and once you do that, it turns into an allergy. And we're gonna replace it back again. So it's important, place the first car into the second position and then place back your second car to the first position. So as you guys can see, there it is. So there is the, the glitchy modded Lowrider is between the slot number one and two. You're gonna step into the fresh LG again. Right here, I'm gonna choose the second one. What you need to do from here is you're gonna go to options online again and go to players and then join friends job again. So after this part, you don't need your friends anymore inside a job waiting for you. So that's not necessary. So after these two steps, he's off to go. So after that, I be spawned back right into my garage again and what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna walk back to my elevator and I'm gonna hit the, the office garage where I'm on at the moment so I'm in office 3 I'm gonna hit office 3 once again and as you guys can see I just spawn back to the main floor so what I'm gonna do from here on is I'm gonna step right into the third LG again and we're gonna bring this to the mod shop so it's very important to follow every every single step because this is a very easy glitch to perform. It's not difficult at all, but you need to follow the steps. And once again, when you arrived in a mod shop, just back out and go back to the office garage again. So in this case, it was office number three for me, and I'm gonna drive it back out there. So from here on, you're gonna repeat every single step eight and nine every single time again to duplicate all your other cars. So when you just spawn back, you're gonna step inside your um, glitchy uh, lowrider. And what you have to do is, you're gonna use this car a lot of times. When you step into your glitchy lowrider, you're gonna hit right D-pad. In the mod shop, you need to change the number plate, that's it, and then back out. So you need to do this with every fresh LG. Drive it into the mod shop, drive it back out into your garage, step into the glitchy lowrider, change the number plate and that's it after you've done that you won't see any allergies will be changing in your game that part will come later on so if you guys have just seen i just changed my number plate and i'm just gonna send this lowrider back to my garage as you guys can see here <clears throat> so 
So this one is already finished guys. So from here on, I'm gonna do every single LEG every single time. I'm gonna repeat the steps over and over again. So this is the number four LEG. I'm gonna step in, I'm gonna hit the right D-pad. I'm gonna bring it inside the mod shop. I'm gonna back out because I'm not gonna do anything with this fresh LEG. And once we back out, like so, backing out into the office garage, and it should spawn us back inside the office garage again. And once that happens, you're gonna step off your LEG and you're gonna walk back to your glitchy lowrider dupe that is stuck between the first and the uh, uh, first and the third car. So I'm gonna check something out first. I'm gonna go to the blue circle, and as you guys can see, the number two LEG is showing up as a normal LEG, but it's actually already a customized LEG. So just to be clear, you can't see it right now at this moment. So once that has been confirmed that your second LG is looking like a normal one, but it is in the list showing up as uh, the, the duplicated one right over here. So once I'm gonna, uh, once I just verify that, I'm gonna step back into my glitchy lowrider, <clears throat> and I'm gonna bring it into my matchup again. When I'm driving it inside the mod shop, what I have to do is change the number plate and it doesn't matter which one you're gonna take and then back out to your office garage again. So you're gonna repeat this over and over again with every single LG. Bring a fresh LG inside the mod shop, back out, step into your glitched lowrider, bring it into the mod shop, change the number plate and back out to the garage again. And when that happens, your fresh LG is already uh, duplicated, but you can't see it right now at the moment. So I'm gonna also do this uh, with every single one of them. And I'm not gonna speed things up from right here. And as you guys can see, the number three is also a duplicated one. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna select this car and I'm gonna hover it over the fourth, sorry, the second over the third car. And as you guys can see, it just showed as a duplicated a lowrider. So I'm gonna repeat my steps uh, over and over again. So I was uh, right over here, the number four, I believe it was. Yep, because that one doesn't count between the first and the second one. I'm gonna step into this fresh LG. I'm gonna bring it inside the match up again, once again, guys. And I'm gonna change my, uh, I'm gonna not gonna change anything, sorry guys. I'm gonna back out and I'm gonna step into my glitch lowrider and I'm gonna just change the number plates. That's it, it's very easy, very simple. The step-by-step -step description is um, uh, very clear. It is a very clear and easy glitch to perform. But you need to get money to start this out first. Like I said in the beginning of the video, because the first pass can be very buggy when you try to join a, jobs, uh, a friend's job, um, it sometimes also will spawn you back into the custom auto shop. Um, in that case, you will lose your lowrider that you just upgraded. So when you close your GTA app and start things over again, you need to modify a fresh LG again. So you will lose another 1.7, 1.8 million again if you messed up the first part. So that's a very tricky because when I uh, try to perform this glitch, it happens a couple times to me, also to my friend. So when that happens, it's gonna cost you a lot of money, guys. So um, it's not expensive or, or not a cheap one, but if you do it correctly, you can um, earn a lot of money. So in one floor, sorry, in one office garage, you can store 20 cars, but you need to invest at least 1.8 million, uh, just round it up to 2 million to an LG. But if you fill up all your cars inside your garage right here, you're gonna do 20 times, um, uh, yeah, almost one, min one million because the car is selling for 954, I believe it was. You're gonna get back around, yeah, 20 million. So the profit of one office garage, if you do it right at the first time, you can make a profit of 18 million per time. But I don't expect that a lot of people will succeed the first time already. So I think you're gonna uh, upgrade an LG more than one time when you try it for the first time. So, but the profit is still very nice, guys. 
Um, just the first couple of steps are very tricky, but after step 9, when you're gonna repeat step 8 and 9, it's very easy and very simple. So as you guys can see, uh, while I'm still talking, that I'm still uh, doing the same steps, I'm tracking a fresh LG and I'm gonna drive it into the matchup, back out, step into my glitchy lowrider and change the number plate and back out to my office again. So this is the last car I'm gonna do right now. You can do it with uh, all the other cars on the other floors, but my garage is already full. So after this video, I'm gonna empty my office garage and I'm gonna stack them with the LEDs and I'm also repeat this money glitch again. So um, after that, uh, like I said guys, uh, step into your glitchy lowrider that's this one between one and the second uh, slot drive it back into your match up and change the number plate so i'm gonna drive it back in guys and i'm gonna change the number plate like so here you go and I'm gonna step out of it. So at this moment, all my fresh allergies, as you guys can see, the, the white ones at least, are also duplicated. And I'm gonna verify that with going to the blue circle. As you guys can see, all of the allergies are customized, but it was shown as white. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna go back to my office. And when I arrive to my office, I'm gonna go back to my garage again. And when that happens, you will see that all the white fresh allergies will turn into a custom modified duplicated lowrider. So from this moment on, you only got lowriders duplicated successfully and you can store them or sell them. It depends if you have the daily sell limit. I just didn't have it so I could also show you that I actually can sell this car so that's also bypassing the waiting time so that's very nice. Again guys the founder Tuto Fossil France did a nice job again. So as you guys can see the white fresh allergies turned also into the modified lowrider as you guys can see. I'm gonna bring this car out. This was not the original one. This one is also a duplicated one and I'm gonna drive it to Los Santos Custom and sell this thing. So. I believe I chose all the most expensive upgrades. I'm not sure about that, but I'm getting 954k for this duplication. So it's not bad. And since the import export DLC, this has become the most uh, expensive car that you actually can duplicate and sell it for. So it surpassed the Sultan RS and the Donk. And this one is now the most expensive lowrider that you actually, I'm not sure even it's a, it's a low rider category, uh, what is at least a super and it's uh, at least the highest possible uh, car that you can sell in this game because the new price is below 50k, in this case it's even free. So I'm gonna drive into Los Santos Customs and I'm gonna sell it for 954. So I hope you enjoyed this video guys, um, thanks for watching again, like and subscribe. I want to thank Mason, I want to thank Malcolm, I want to thank Heisenberg for helping me out in this video. Nick Vendotti signing out and I see you on the next video.